welcome to another video. I think this video is like opposite, I'm not sure. But today, the day you're watching this, it's currently Tuesday. Excuse the messy bed in the background. Today is my 23rd birthday. Now it doesn't seem long ago since I did my 22nd birthday video. It just comes around so quick. And if you're wondering why it's so wide, um, this shot, it's because I have a gorilla pod. Yes, all the YouTubers have gorilla pods and they can do like really cool shots with them and as I've said in previous videos I would like to do different kind of shots if I'm in like a hotel or something I'd like to be able to put the camera down sometimes and do these kind of shots so hopefully my videos might get a little bit better now so I thought I'd do a quick sort of what I got for my birthday haul and this will probably be mixed in with the weekend because I'm obviously going to be doing celebrating with my friends at the weekend because I've had to work today so there's not really a lot I can film uh, so yeah so it'll be like a a little haul for everybody uh, for what I've got so if you're not interested and interested in that then I'm sorry so let me just set you up and I will see you in a little second I'm hoping this angle's okay I'm obviously not used to this yet so I'm just chesting out the angles but I do like how it, the legs bend so you can get it into the right position. And this is the box that it came in. So it's just called a Gorilla Pod and you can stick your GoPros on it and you can bend it around trees and stick your camera on. And it comes with the right thing so you can just stick your camera straight on, the right fastener. Uh, I've been wanting one of these for ages so I'm really, really happy with this. Um, because I have wanted to do more creative type videos like I've mentioned. So an update in my life very quickly is I did get a PS4, I ended up buying one myself which again in my PS3 haul video I mentioned that I was hoping to get a PS4 soon because the South Park game is out although for some reason it's pushed back now until March and it was, oh sorry, it was meant to come out in December so that's pretty annoying but oh well. So I got a game for that, I have already got three other games but I finished them so it's well and the other one I didn't really get on well with which when I do a proper PS4 haul I will explain so the other two games I've one I finished and one I've nearly finished so I haven't had any games to play so I've got Watch Dogs which I've literally just started it's like it's on my TV right now on mute while I just filmed this video and I've wanted this game for a while because it's looked um really cool it's like hacking into people's systems and um helping people and quests and stuff so I've not got very far into it but I'm liking what I'm seeing so far so yeah if anyone's got Watch Dogs or Watch Dogs 2 let me know what you think about this because I have, like I said I'm not really that far into it I've literally just started it today so yeah I've also ordered the new Tomb Raider because it comes out actually today on my birthday so I'm just waiting for that to come in the post and then I will have another game for my collection and I'll be able to play that when it comes which I'm very, very excited about because I love the Tomb Raider games, as I've said in previous videos. The next one is Peter Kay's Car Share, which, if again, if you're not from the UK, you will not know what this is. Unless it's shown over there, I don't know. But it's Peter Kay, uh, who's, done, who's a comedian, and he's done like a sketch show of him going to work in his car, and he's had to car share with a colleague from work. That's basically the plot. It's so funny. It's brilliant. One of my favourite things. You wouldn't think from being sat in a car in a comedy would work but it does so this is series one currently filming series two so i'm very very happy about that see so yeah, i got the blu-ray of peter k's car share from my brother which i wasn't expecting at all so that was a nice surprise gift i also got these socks while well, i remember that have got like smiley donuts on you can't see i'll show you like this can you see oh can't see if you can see that it's got like donuts on it and they're pretty cool i like i can just pick my uh, pot gorilla pod up and then just carry on talking next one i've got two books next so this is we were on a break by lindsay kelt which is her newest book now i did pre-order this um, and then i decided to un-pre-order it because i thought i'll put it on my birthday list because mum and dad were like what do you want for your birthday we don't have any ideas so i put this on my list and i thought i'll definitely get it because they know i love lindsay kelt she's like one of my favorite authors so once I've finished reading my other book, which I'm reading, this will probably be my next read. I'm not sure. I've got quite a lot of books on my list to get through. So, And the next one, which I'm so, so happy about. Like, honestly, this book, I ordered it on Amazon, and it was meant to come out, like, in September, the end of September. 
and it said it wouldn't come until the 14th of October so I was like I'll just put that on my birthday list because I'm sure it'll be out in shops and it's Mara Wilson's Where Am I Now so it's like her story of why she's not acting anymore and what she's up to in her life Oh, I'm just so excited. Like, Mara Wilson, I grew up with Mara Wilson films. She's one of my favourite actresses. Matilda's, like, my all-time favourite film. I love Mrs Doubtfire, Miracle on 34th Street. I love basically all the films she's been in. So to have that, it's just, like, so fu so exciting. Like, I cannot wait to sit down and read it. Like, that's how excited I am. Oh, let's just move you back. So, yeah, that's um, everything I've got so far. But as I've said, I'm meeting, like, my friends and that at the weekend. So, I haven't got everything yet, which will be, because I'll see them on Saturday, which will be featured in this vlog. So, on Saturday, you'll be able to see everything else that I got. I also got some money off both my grandparents, and I also got some cards and some presents from people at work. So, thank you if anyone did get me anything. It's very much appreciated, because I never expect to get anything. You know, it's just a birthday to me, and people saying happy birthday is just enough for me, but it's very nice when people think about you and buy you something. So that is appreciated. Uh, yeah, so what I think about the PS4 while I'm videoing, I need to fill in some time because it's a very short video. PS4 I'm loving at the moment, it's so much better than the PS3. Like the PS3 was good, but like I just love how it can in it can update a game without you having to have the disc in. So I was watching Netflix the other night and it was updating my game whilst I was watching Netflix. I didn't even have a game in, I think I had a DVD in at that point. I think that's a really, really cool feature. I also think that the what's new features really cool so you can see what people are playing, uh, what trophies people have earned and all that stuff. Um, I really really think that's a great feature and I think the PS3 should have had that. That's just me. I think I just like being nosy at other people's games and stuff but you can also um, yeah you can just also see what they're up to and get ideas from what kind of game. You can do screenshots, see people's um, what's it called, PS4 share, love that, I love how you can do um, stand, stand rest mode, so when I, oops, so when I was installing Uncharted 4, which took about 20 hours, because my internet's really bad, I left it on rest mode, so then I could still watch the TV and do other things, so I think that's a really, really tidy feature, that is like one of my favourite features, because it also charges the controller as well. Uh, what else? Pretty much everything else is pretty similar to the PS3. I just think it's a lot fresher, a lot cleaner, and since they've updated it, the notifications are now white instead of black, which I like. I think that's really, really um, clean and fresh as well. So yes, um, I think that's everything I've got to say for now. I might vlog a little bit later um, if we do decide to do anything. I think I'm going to get a McDonald's for tea, so that's pretty cool. So I'm going to go to the drive through to get a McDonald's and have that. So yeah, I might catch you later. If not, I will catch you at the weekend. Package time! My package finally came. Sorry about the terrible lighting. I've had to put my phone light on just because, like I've said, this video does not pick up very well in low light. So, yay! Very happy! Boom, 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 boom. Two made a 20 year celebration. This box looks so good. So, let's do like a quick unboxing when I can find the end to unbox. Battery's low again on this camera, so hopefully I can get this clip in before it dies. That would be nice, wouldn't it? I'm sorry for all the shadows, but I am the worst filmer ever, so excuse me. Oh, the satisfaction of taking one of these off. Oh, yes, it's my first game with like a special cover on, look at that. That looks so nice. And then you've got the game in there. The disc. Incredible. That looks so good. So happy with that. So yes, that's an update. Just got my game and I'm going to charge my camera now. So if I want to do any more clips I can. So I'll catch you on the flip side. This is why my games take forever to download. Just put Tomb Raider in to see how long it would have. Five hours, although that's not too bad. I've had them at like 48 hours before. Ridiculous. So I'm just off out to McDonald's, so I've just put a hoodie on and a beanie because it's raining outside. The weather has been horrible today. Um, and I've just looked at the Tomb Raider box and it's got like some cool pictures in and stuff, so 
I'm gonna have to share that on the vlog another time when it's lighter because you can't see it oh, in the dark. So that's what's happening. Uh, I might try and do a montage, but it's too dark with this camera, I think. So we'll see. Oi, oi. There's the famous M. McDonald's soon. Just in Sainsbury's car park at the moment. Good morning. You catch me getting ready for work this morning. How is everyone? I hope you've all had a good week so far. Can't believe how fast this week's gone. In fact, I can't believe how quick this year has gone. It just seems to have flown by incredibly fast. And it's like the run up to Christmas, once Halloween and Bonfire Night are done, then the run up to Christmas begins. <sighs> so yeah, that's exciting. <sighs> so outfit today is, I've just got a jumper and a shirt on because it is quite cold, but it's like hot in work. So I just take my jumper off when I'm inside and then just some blue trousers. We can't wear jeans or anything like that. So yes, I can vlog a little bit today because I'm not in work for very long. So I'll be vlogging bits probably throughout the day if I can. I've also got the doctors and I've also got college as well today. So there might not be too much footage, but we shall see. I didn't realise what time it was, but so quickly hurry up and go so i'm just gonna take my iron tablet which is why i'm going to the doctor's today as my iron has been giving me well a lot of trouble making me feel more tired when it shouldn't be it should be having the opposite effect basically so after work about two o'clock i'm going there and i've got college at six So let's quickly go back upstairs because I've got to unbrush my teeth. Well, that was a close up. But please let me know what you think of um, this vlogging style. Trying new things now that I've got a tripod. I'm really, really excited to try new, new things. Are there anywhere to put anything in this bathroom? So I'm just going to leave you here for a second. But I like how I can line up my shots and talk to you like this instead of me constantly holding. A camera. Why I'm not already at work because it is like 11am. Um, I don't always work mornings so I generally do start at um, lunch times. So if you're wondering why my hours are different to last year at the moment which I'll explain more about but right now I've got to rush off to work and this charge need, this charger, this camera needs charging so while I'm away I will charge you and then I will get back to you after work. Whew, and I'm back slight change of jumper I put my Gryffindor one on which if you watch my Harry Potter vlog you might have seen me mention this and it is the warmest jumper I live in it so much it's so nice so yeah um not much else to report I'm just gonna have some dinner and then go to the doctors and then I will come back and uh, let you know how that went I'll see you in a little pile back from the doctors I went to have my blood test done straight away at the hospital because the hospital was literally next to the doctors and was in straight away um, and they're testing me for vitamin D and my sugar to see if that's anything to do with why I'm feeling tired even though I'm on these tablets and I think now I'm going to read Tom Fletcher's books I've just started it the Christmas Christmasaurus loving it so far if you're a McFly fan you've probably already got the book but if you've got children it is a children's book about a dinosaur at Christmas so I would highly recommend it because I'm really enjoying it and I'm an adult so I imagine kids will really really enjoy it and then I'll probably play Tomb Raider because I've been loving Tomb Raider as well at the moment uh, and yeah that's all I've really got to 
to say. So I'll probably see you in the next couple of days with my friends having a few drinks. <clears throat> it's the weekend and today is the day where I'm out with all my friends for food and a few drinks. So really excited. Don't know if I'll film anything because it's going to be very, very busy because it's going to be five o'clock and it's... <clears throat> the time when everyone's going to be there for eating so TGI as well is usually one of the busiest places in Meadow Hall so sorry if there's not a lot of footage but this has been like a mixture of days on the vlog so this will probably be a long vlog anyway maybe even two vlogs, who knows? I don't know until I edit it but my outfit of the day I have got a red cardigan um, my white dress and then blue tights yeah I thought I'd go a little bit more smart kind of thing because I always wear sort of jeans and t-shirts and hoodies and things like that and I thought because it's going to be my birthday celebrations I may as well dress up nicely my hair looks a little bit wavy but I suppose that just adds to, adds to it and yeah I didn't think there was much point doing anything with it because it just gets messy anyway but I don't think it looks too bad so come along join me and I might film a few clips for you if not I'm sorry but that's just how it goes sometimes. And I'm back home. I said I probably wouldn't film anything, but it was a really, really fun night. It's not actually that late now, but we went for food and just had a few drinks, like I said. And it was ex extremely busy in there as well, so I didn't really want to film, and it'd just be a lot of noise and not be able to hear anything. And we're back in the crappy <laughs> setup of my phone light again, just while I sort out a proper light for my room. I'm just going to show you the rest of the gifts that I got, because obviously... Um, my friends all have got me stuff because it's a bit later than my birthday late birthday presents they even know what I'm saying but yeah so my friend Holly which I've talked about Holly quite a quite a few times in my vlogs and now you can't see them I light hang on quite a few times got me a couple of presents so I will show you so first off is like my big soap and glory set which she looked back on some of my YouTube videos and saw that I was um, very very excited about soap and glory and that I loved that because I got that bought for one Christmas by my ex-boyfriend's mum and I was on about it in a video so and that comes with one of your fluffies and I've also got a cold really really sorry about the sneezing you get the righteous butter like, honestly it smells incredible uh, scrub of your life this one scrub of your life Hand and foot cream, which is very useful because I do get quite sore feet and dry skin. So, And shower gel. Honestly, the shower gel is one of my favourite things. It smells incredible. One of the nicest um, brands, I think, Soap & Glory. It's probably one of my favourite brands. It's just quite expensive, so I don't buy it that often. Let's put that back there so my light's a bit more in frame. The next one she got me was some fruity bath fizzes because... She'd seen that I was also into bath fizzes. Uh, I do have a lot of bath fizzes, but I love them. So every time I have a bath, I do put a fruity or bath fizz in. So that's going to be cool to use. The next one, again, is a Zoella cream, body cream. And it's the new one from her French patisserie range. I think that's what you call it. Creme pour la Cops. And this smells really, really cool. Uh, I haven't, I've actually already got one of these because I bought one myself one. It's always nice to have another one. But I haven't actually opened my other one yet, so they will last me a long, long time. And the last one she got was the Zoella makeup bag. So I don't really wear makeup, but it'll be really, really handy for spare change because I don't have anything to keep my change in. And Danielle bought me a coaster, which says, step aside coffee, this is a job for alcohol, which I really, really love. So I'm going to change that over from my Superman one and use this one for a little while, I think. So yeah, thank you to everybody that has bought me gifts, that sent me cards, whether that was on my birthday, whether you're from work, whether family, friends, whether that was today, any day, thank you so much. It is really, really appreciated. And I've really, really, and I've really had a nice day. That's all I've really got to talk about. This is like the end of the, the birthday vlogs, but I'll be vlogging on Thursday because I'm going to Yumi at 6 with Cheryl. Cheryl's back in the vlogs. Woo! I was so much like so much fun with Cheryl and so many laughs. So yeah, I'm excited. So if you did enjoy this video, give it a like. Please subscribe down below. It would really, really help me out and I would love my channel to grow. Uh, leave a comment. Uh, yeah, I will see you next time. Bye!